Actually, we've changed rocks. We started out, we were in a basalt. And now we have this more pink colored rock. You can see in the cliffs over there and just some pieces here. It's pink, it's got little chunks of other rocks in it. Um, so this is a tuff, uh, which is a volcanic rock formed explosively. Um, usually from eruptions of, of large, well, basically super volcanoes that erupt uh, magma that's rich in silicon, uh, SiO2. Uh, or I guess then it's silica, technically. Um, and so these tufts, I believe, are part of a rock formation called the Quitsun Volcanics, uh, which are about 25 million years old. Um, so we're going... I think if you were to look up in the canyon, you'd find that there's... See, up on that mountain, there's still a black basalt up on top. And then we're down lower are these pink tufts and other volcanic rocks. They're part of the Quitsun Volcanics, uh, which again are quite a bit older. The basalt on top, I'm actually not sure those are well dated here, but uh, similar looking rocks in, in nearby ranges are a few million years old. Looks like more of that uh, Quitsun Formation tuff. Basically, tuff is made of tiny bits of volcanic ash from a volcanic eruption that are all welded together. They're often welded immediately following the eruption because the ash lands and it's still so hot that it melts back together, basically. Um, but that can only happen after a very particularly large eruption. So this is why I was saying earlier, they're typically associated with super volcanoes or large caldera forming eruptions, we'd call them, if you want to be fancy, which I often do. Sorry, there's a lot of jargon in geology. I'll try to explain it when I remember to.